I mean, we could just go across the street to the park right here. Oh, yeah, my, my, my cell phone ringing. Hold on. Can you hear me now? Yeah. So what day did you say? Oh, yeah. Hey, babes. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Brittany, a.k.a. Brittany Dora. How y'all doing? So y'all, this is the first official video that I am recording in 2023. <sighs> Sorry about that y'all, my phone was ringing. <laughs> so I had to answer that. But anyway, so this is the first vlog that I am actually recording and putting out in 2023. Today, it, it is the end of the month y'all. It's like, I've been busy, y'all. I have been working like crazy. You know, working 12s is tough. Like, it is really tough, y'all. Um, I always said I never would, but I don't know how I didn't came into this 12-hour nurse. I don't know how, when it happened. But yeah, that's me. That's my life now. I do 12s. And, um, your girl been busy. Like, I be wanting to pick y'all up, but y'all, when I go to work, pitch black dark. When I come home from work, it's pitch black dark. <laughs> um, when I don't really get breaks I mean I do I get breaks like here and there but you know not long enough to really sit down and talk to y'all and get y'all cut up because most of the times I'm doing a working break to where like I'm sitting on the floor and I'm eating you know what I mean and when I'm on the floor families come up residents come up you know co-workers come up um, so it's not really private enough for me to really just whip out my phone and really talk to y'all the way I like talking to y'all because y'all my people so I apologize for that um, so with that all being said, I'm really trying to figure out how I can move forward, how I'm going to, not how can I, cause I'm going to do it. I'm going to get it done, but how I'm going to move forward with my channel because I work so sporadically. Like I don't have a set schedule. I don't have a Monday through Friday, nine to five. Um, I work whatever, like I work weekends, I work day shift, I work mid shift, I work midnights every once in a blue, not often, but I will do one every once in a blue. So like, I, I, it's hard for me to say I'm gonna do a weekly vlog and then a weekend vlog because I may be working that whole weekend. I may be working throughout the week. Like it, it flip flops and turns so much that I just don't know the best way to schedule content. So that's what I'm working on right now. Um, in addition to that, y'all, as y'all know, your girl is going back to school, yeah. Yeah, I guess I'm glutton for punishment or whatever. Because <laughs> I'm really tired of school. I'm tired of school. But, you know, we got plans and dreams and aspirations over here. So, that's going to be starting. So, that's going to be another little curveball that I'm going to have to figure out. Because I'm not sure how I'm going to be able to manage my time. Because um, this is a master's program. So, you know, with master's, you know, bachelorette, master's, there's a whole lot of writing. There's a whole lot of reading. There's a whole lot of self study self teach and I have to figure out how I'm going to manage all of that so yeah that's what I'm working on right now y'all lately like I have been off I've been off for a couple of days and I have just been enjoying time with my family trying to get stuff done around the house um you know try, kind of like the calm before the storm because I feel like it's going to get crazy starting next month when I actually have to figure out work school kids schedules their activities you know my fiance still making sure that you know i'm still doing what i gotta do in that realm like it's just i feel like it's gonna be a lot i'm trying not to stress myself out too much because y'all your girl stress I, I suffer from stress alopecia last summer took your girl out um yeah it took me out I think it was a combo of the stress and also the fact that my dumb behind decided to, ooh, oh, handicap, crap. Ooh, over there though, <laughs> let me go get that parking spot. <laughs> but, um, what was I saying? So yeah, I think me losing so much hair last year had to deal with, number one, stress, because I really do suffer from stress alopecia. I have my whole entire life. Um, and then also, is that handicapped too? I know it's not. And y'all, I was just getting tired of my hair. Like, 
I always wear wigs um, or braids. That's my go-to. Um, some type of protective style. And I wasn't really taking care of my natural hair. So I'm like, well, girl, just go ahead and perm it. That way you can, you know, you can have more versatile styles or whatever, you know. Um, so I did it. Loved it for a while. I really didn't get any pictures, too many pictures with my hair down. But yeah, my it was inches. Your girl had inches or whatever. Um, but it was bone straight and it was super duper thin. And the summer is so, it was so hot this summer. So literally like I was just wearing my hair for that period of time in the summertime when I really wasn't vlogging, your girl hair was out. And then like a month after, like I noticed it started to go. Like it was starting to fall out slowly. And then quickly, like it was coming out in clumps. I was literally combing my hair and I would have lumps and lumps of hair so literally my hair right now is in a horrible state i'm kind of in denial i'm kind of like if i don't if i don't pay attention to it it's not really there which is horrible which is horrible when it first started falling out i mentioned this in one of my videos too a while back but my sis sharana the goddess she has um my hands ashy she she has a hair care line she offers this grease and this oil i ordered it i love it it immediately changed the texture of my hair i mean made it feel so much softer and more manageable so i was using that i did see a difference especially in my edges my edges weren't horrible you know what i mean but i noticed that they got thicker like a lot thicker because you know some of the hairstyles i wear do put stress on them so i did that for a while hair was still falling out so i kind of just stopped like i just stopped everything which is horrible so um i was watching my girl my fellow ohioan it's beyond g g i'm gonna put her channel over here y'all because i'm probably saying that wrong but she recently did the big chop and i commented under her videos like girl i needed to see this because like i need to stop procrastinating and just get it done y'all i just need to get it done and do it because what i'm doing to my hair right now is not helping anybody um i do still have some length in the front in the back y'all dang they're gone but in the front up here i still got length like if i were to go like this and stretch my hair down it'll probably be it'll come under my chin and i don't know why that just being able to do this means so much to me but at the end of the day like sis what would that really matter when <laughs> for one you're not taking care of it for two you got it wrapped up and dirty up under the stocking cap and number three it's damaged like it's extremely damaged so pretty soon i'm not sure when because i'm still I'm still wrapping my head around the fact that it's okay. Like, it is okay to cut it. Like, it's okay. And I'm going to do it. Like, I'm going to do it. So, y'all be on the lookout for that. And again, shout out to her. Because, like I said, she's so beautiful. Like, oh, my God. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and link her video down below, too, where she cut her hair. And she styled it. Stunning. Stunning with hair. Stunning without. So, yeah, girl. Shout out to you. Thank you for inspiring me and letting me know that it's okay. It's going to be okay. But yeah, I didn't talk to you for about eight minutes. Let me get out this car. Go ahead and get into this store. Um, I didn't even tell you why I was here. So I'm at this store. I need, I'm coming here to get a bin because y'all, my tree's still up. Yeah, I know. Whatever. Judge me. Go ahead. Stephanie already did. Life of Steph vlogs. I was talking to her. I was like, yeah, my tree's still up. And she was like, what? I'm like, oh, you judging me? She's like, yeah. <laughs> and I was like, how are you going to judge me? Because first of all, I told everybody that, number one, my tree be up to Valentine's Day. I'm getting it down before Valentine's Day, so that should be a round of applause. Like, anyway, I'm gonna go get this bin so I can take my tree down. Oh, that I was looking for. I think I'm gonna get this one. This one is a 30 gallon. So, yeah. I mean, we could just go across the street to the park right here. Oh, y'all, my sister, my cell phone, ringing. hold up. Can you hear me? Yeah. So what day did you say?
I shouldn't. I met him in Philly, and the name was Brad. See, we been making love constantly. That's why my eyes are a shade. Black Burgundy. The way that we kiss is unlike any other way that I be kissing when I'm kissing what I miss. Won't you listen? Brown sugar, babe. I guess high off your love. I don't know how to be. Hey, Rex. So. As you see, your girl is in the bed. <laughs> the bed. I'm real tired, y'all. I'm ready to go to sleep. But before I go, I wanted to go ahead and close out this video. And I wanted to show y'all. The Lord works in mysterious ways, y'all. So I was just telling y'all, um, before I went into the store, how I was planning on taking better care of my hair. And, you know, I'm going to do what I need to do. I have been ne neglecting it. Let me show y'all this gold mine. This gold mine I stumbled upon. Y'all, I got two full big bags of hair products. <laughs> so, y'all know, I messed with the Mayel brand. This Rosemary and Mint Strengthening Shampoo. This was in my hygiene haul. I bought this from Target. I don't remember how much I paid for it, but y'all, look at the price. $1.99. I checked the expiration date. Girl, we are good. So, I got two of these, I believe. yeah so i got two of those they didn't have the conditioner but it's okay i'll buy the conditioner because what i'm saving like it's fine so got this i also got this one this one is the pomegranate and honey curl smoothie this will be for my kids especially the little one as y'all seen earlier yeah he's due to get his braids redone so i'm gonna be using this on him again $1.99 I'll stick. I'll go by brand. Um, so again, sticking with the Mayel. This is a pomegranate and honey curl defining mousse with hold. Y'all, this is perfect for laying your edges. Yeah, got me two of these. Again, everything was a dollar ninety nine, y'all. I also got the leave in conditioner. And y'all. <laughs> The star of the show, who is that? I know. In the background, y'all, I'm sorry. I'm watching my girl, Chrissy. Hey, Chrissy Boo. Supporting my girl as always. But I'm going to show y'all the star in a minute because I was thirsty. I took it out the bag already. But let me keep going. So now we have. This is the hair strengthening mask, also in that rosemary mint. If y'all do not know, rosemary is great for growing your hair. So, we got this. Actually got two of those. I didn't know that. <laughs> oh, here we go. I thought I put them all away. Y'all, the star of the show, y'all. Viral. TikTok. Everywhere. Everybody's talking about this. Um, this is the rosemary mint. Roseberry Mint Scalp and Hair Strengthening Oil Infused with Biotin for hair growth, y'all. They say this is the magic growth oil. I got four of them. $1.99. All right, what else we got? This my uh, Okay, we also got this deep conditioner. I think I got two of those. Yep, yeah, I got two of those. And I believe that is all for my L. Nope, I'm lying. <laughs> I'm lying. I got two of these. these. This is the Rice Water Collection, the Shine Mist. And it says it's excellent for length retention. So, got that. All right, moving on to the other stuff that I got. So I got the Camille Rose. This one is the curl maker. This one is marshmallow and agave leaf extract. That sounds so good. We got this. And as y'all know, I got a couple of curly head kids. So this will definitely come in handy. So you know me, I got two. <laughs> and then I got their 
Rejuva Drops. So this is also for um, hair growth. This has castor oil, peppermint oil, and saw pimento. We're going to be trying this one out. Sorry, y'all. Y'all keep looking at my mouth. <laughs> and then lastly, we got Kaleidoscope. So if y'all don't, if y'all not familiar with this brand, um, the brat, her wife, fiance, I don't know. Um, this is her brand. So I want to try these out. And these are called Miracle Drops. So we're going to see. And I'm going to not do everything all together. <laughs> I'm not going to mix it because I want to be able to pinpoint y'all. That was about to fall off anyway. But I want to be able to pinpoint what's really working or whatever. So. Yeah, that was my little surprise haul, y'all. I was so happy to come across this, especially considering, like, none of it's getting ready to expire. Like, I'm not sure what's going on. I have my thoughts, so don't quote me. Go ahead and fact check me, somebody, please. But in these TikTok streets, y'all, they talking. They talking about this right here. It's going around that. How can I say this? People in which this product was not designed for are using it and leaving crazy reviews, even though this product was not made for them. So now some stores are starting to like pull back on it. And I'm cool. I'm cool with that. Because if y'all pull back, that means when I go in the store to go get it, it may actually be on the shelf. Because y'all was buying it out. But anyway, that's why I think I was able to get this for this price um and yeah i'm just happy y'all i'm i'm happy so i'm gonna go ahead and close this out i want to thank you again so much for watching i love you all so much and i will see you guys in the next video